Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a sold-out show here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. I'm Michael Cole here with Taz at Ringside. Man, you couldn't fit another fan in here with a crowbar, I'm telling you. There's a whole lot of cheese heads in the house tonight. It sure is. Green Bay knows that they're about to see the greatest superstars in all of sports entertainment. I can't wait to get started. Man, his opponent looked like a punk with that counter. What a counter that was! Man, this match is so good, it's even worth sitting next to you to watch it, Paul. Thanks a lot, Taz. You know, you're not always my number one choice for a podcast partner, either. You know what you should do, Girl Pants? You should team up with Jerry Lawler. They, they could be the king and queen on commentary. Real funny, Taz. You know, that would almost be worth not having to work with a joker like you all the time. I hope this isn't the last time we see these superstars face off. You're not going to hear me say this much, Cole, but I definitely agree with you. This has all the makings of a nice, long feud. I don't know how nice it is, but there are certainly some issues between these superstars, and I think this match might only exasperate them. Please, Cole, watch your language, will you? It's a family show. I said exasperate. Not, oh, never mind. And there's the counter, Cole. Oh, no. We've seen this before. We sure have. The Samoan spike. Oh, man, let me tell you. That's a move that takes a fight at you in a hockey. I got to tell you, Cole, I thought I had this thing figured out. But now I got no idea how this is going to end up. Neither do I, Taz. And I think it's that unpredictability that makes it so exciting. No doubt, Cole. I've seen superstars get a huge advantage over their opponents and still lose the match because they got sloppy. Anything could happen in WWE. An entire match can turn on one or two big moves. And that's why you can't take your eyes off the action for one second. You never know when something huge is going to go down. Ladies and gentlemen, we are seeing an incredible display of athletic ability here tonight. What do you expect, Cole? He's a WWE superstar for crying out loud. They're the greatest athletes in the world. True enough, Taz. There's no off-season for them. There's no month or two. He smells blood in the water, Cole. He's going straight for the submission. And this could prove to be a decisive moment in this match. Here's the reversal, Cole. I love hearing the crowd come alive. What a submission maneuver. You must be familiar with this one, Taz. Yeah, I've been on both sides of it, Cole. That's the truth. And let me tell you, it's better to give than to see. Man, I'm telling you, from my in-ring experience, trust me, you could cut this tension with a... It looks like he's decided to finish off his opponent. And what a way to do it. A tombstone power drive. He wasted no time going for that pin. This is one heck of a match so far. It sure is, Taz. What do you think the highlight is? I've been locked in this hole before, and it hurts even worse than it looks. I can't even imagine the amount of pain that this hole must have clicked on any superstar who winds up in it. Man, I'll tell you what, man, this one's just turned into a fight, pure and simple. We knew it was going to be intense. We knew it was going to be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I've got to admit, it kind of took me by surprise, Cole. That don't happen too often. That's an understatement. You've been in hundreds of matches in your career. We both called hundreds more. We usually have a pretty good idea of what to expect, but not this time. I guess it just goes to show you, Cole, like they say, anything can happen here in the WWE. I think we're hearing the First Amendment in action. He's got his opponent trapped in a turnbuckle, and here comes the double sandwiches. And from the looks of things, they taste even worse than they look. There's nowhere to go once you're backed into that turnbuckle. Yeah, not when your opponent's dishing out the punches like this. He 
It's so great seeing these athletes compete here tonight. I had a feeling they were going to wind up against each other sooner or later. There were times when it seemed like it wasn't going to happen, but I can't... Wow, look at that submission. I ain't never seen it executed better. Neither have I, partner. And this might be enough to get the tap out right here. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. That's the law of the jungle, Cole. And injured superstars like a wounded animal. It's survival of the fittest. And that also means that if you're not at 100%, you've got to be able to hide it from your opponent. You got that right, Cole. This business is as psychological as it is physical. You can't let your opponent think they're easy picking. Well, I wouldn't consider any of these superstars to be easy pickings. No matter how beaten up they get. <clears throat> He's looking to finish off his opponent right here. And that should do it. The Samoan Spice has played many a victim. And we might be able to add one more to the list here tonight. Hey, the ref's got a tough job. I mean, trying to keep these superstars. Uh oh. You know what's coming next, Cole. Tombstone Kyle Driver. Superstars have fallen victim to that over the years. Sounds like this capacity crowd is something on their minds, Pass. Yeah, and now he's going for the cover, Cole. When you see this level of competition, Cole, there is no doubt that SmackDown's just head and shoulders better than Raw. I couldn't agree more, Taz. Raw has some incredible superstars. No, he knows his opponent is completely helpless to resist the submission hole. And that means you gotta either dig deep and find a way to break it, or you gotta just flat out tap out. Man, you talk about superstars and we ain't got an ounce to quit in them, huh? You'll look oh my, there's the submission hole. He's in the driver's seat now. <laughs> No doubt, Cole, if your opponent lets you lock that in, it usually means that they ain't got much left. He's going for the pin, Cole. One, Here's your winner, you...